Hi, my name is Antoine Lee. I am the dramaturg over at Musical Theatre West's production of Ain't Misbehavin'. And today I want to give you a little historical context to help you enjoy the show a little better. Or maybe you're just curious. So either way, here's some history. Ain't Misbehavin' is a musical review that features the music of Fats Waller. This music and Fats himself, the composer, they are both direct products of the Harlem Renaissance. Now, what is the Harlem Renaissance, you ask? It is a rebirth, a rebirth of culture, art, institutions, education, all pouring out of the black community in America. This Renaissance, while centered in Harlem, happened in cities like Detroit, Chicago, Philly, wherever there were jobs for formerly enslaved people, There were millions of formerly enslaved people because of the Great Migration. The Great Migration was a period when slavery ended and formerly enslaved people got to go wherever they want and forge their own destinies. Once they got to these big cities like New York and Detroit and Philadelphia, they were able to have something they never had before. Freedom. With this freedom, they were able to be entrepreneurs. They started businesses. They got jobs in the service and hospitality industry. And all of the stability from having a paycheck, having a weekend, allowed black people in America to become artists for the first time. People went from being slaves to being poets, dancers, artists, and their offspring was able to carry this on. And I think that's one of the biggest parts of the Harlem Renaissance that makes it quite revolutionary is the fact that this was a period in time where African Americans were given artistic freedom for the first time ever. Now, there have been other renaissances, uh, most famously the Italian Renaissance during the era of the Medicis. You can see the results of the Italian Renaissance. 100, 200 years in the future, we are still witnessing the results of the Harlem Renaissance. Essentially, African Americans had artistic freedom for roughly 100 years in this country. And it's exciting to see where it might go. And uh, I think it's wonderful that people are performing work by Fats Waller today because it's such an amazing reminder of the places that our country has been and the accomplishments that the African-American people have created for themselves in music and in art. Now, that's just a little bit about the Renaissance, but if you want to really experience what the Harlem Renaissance was like, I can't tell you anymore to come and see Ain't Misbehaving at Musical Theater West. It's such a great show, and I can't wait to see you at the theater.